for me, sustainability, in fact, means a radical rethinking of our relationship with nature. Sustainability to me, I guess, uh, encompasses both ecological issues, so it encompasses sort of, I suppose, what would, might be called biospheric things, um, you know, um, as well as human activity and the impact on non-human species, I suppose. My personal definition of sustainability is very much an individual stance where you're making a declaration that you're trying to use less resource as possible um, to recycle, to think about whether you actually need what you need and whether you can actually do that within your home life and your work life. What can you do to actually minimise the use of resources etc. It's about thinking uh, towards the future but not forgetting what's happening in the past. It is within everybody's sort of uh, remit to actually make a contribution. We should be moving away from uh, the dominant view of our relation with nature which is very much human centred towards a view of our relationship with nature which is which considers human as members of sort of interconnected web of life. We've become used to disposing of everything. From the 1960s onwards, we've always believed that technology, in fact, always believed that technology would improve. But technology just creates a whole new set of problems. I think what we've got to go back to fundamentally is to get people to actually decide what they want. I have a daughter who's a teenager, and actually she gets very frustrated by the fact that um, her friends, her peers, are not interested. You know, it's not cool to be green. So somehow we have to make it cool to be green. What does nature mean to you? What are you doing in your own life? How could you change your life um, to make it more green, more sustainable? Do you actually need that new phone? Do you actually need that new computer? Do you actually need those clothes? Because unless we address that, and, and it's very difficult because society, m the budget on marketing is far outweighs the budget on sustainability, but people have to make a decision. What one thing could you do to make your neighbourhood, the space beyond your front door, a more sustainable place?